Today on Race Beards and Gear, we check out the muffaletta from JHS. The JHS muffaletta is kind of a Swiss army knife of muff fuzzes. There's six muff fuzzes in here, uh, and they are the Civil War, the Russian, the Big Muff Pie, the Triangle, the Ram's Head, and JHS's own 2015 take on a Big Muff Fuzz, which is a little less compressed, and there's more mid-range punch, and it's a little louder. So, I'm gonna check it out. Uh, we're gonna do a little casual playthrough, and I'm gonna switch through some of the modes. I'm not gonna do so much uh, knob turning as turning the main type knob, because uh, I think hearing the differences between the different muffs is really, really cool. They really nailed the, the various voicings and the feel of the various muff fuzzes. Now, for this playthrough, I will be using my custom shop Fender Jaguar 62 reissue into a Fender Blues Junior 4 and the muffletta. And uh, I, it's mic'd with an Audix i5 and what you're hearing is coming straight out of the app. There's been no post-processing of any kind. Let's do it. If you are into the big muff thing, like I am, uh, a muffletta is an answer to a lot of problems, and that is variances between actual vintage pedals. I mean, they varied so widely, and Electroharmonix used whatever components were available at that time when they were building pedals. So one pedal, uh, uh, two pedals of the same vintage will not sound the same at all, ever. So it's cool to have so many different fuzzes um, and big muff buzzes in one housing, like the muffletta. I think it's a really cool idea, and I really think they nailed it without really compromising on the fuzz tones themselves. All the Pokemon links down below in the description. You've been wonderful. I've been Fluff. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you next time.